All right, guys, we're in the all new 2022 BMW iX and we're going to take it for a drive. A nice POV video uh, for you. This is especially for you guys who put a pre-order deposit, haven't had a chance to drive one. I am driving it on your behalf to show you how it is. Oh God, night and day difference immediately on the drive. Yeah. Oh God, <laughs> this is so awesome. Nice. I love this. It's gorgeous luxury class elegance look at that gorgeous curve display touch screen that's the tesla in front of us that i was just in and the ix right immediately after that again for those of you guys who don't know me i am samir umar from bmw toronto please do subscribe to the channel uh, click on the bell icon for more informative content like this uh, comment below and like the video for sure uh, do share it with family and friends uh, so right here we are in the 2022 bmw ix x drive 50 it is an all-wheel drive 516 horsepower tons and tons of range uh, right now we have been using this car for quite a bit uh, yet i'm still left at 246 kilometer range if you guys can see that uh, battery is showing 62 percent uh it does have gesture control so watch my fingers i'm gonna switch the volume off uh because youtube may restrict certain songs on there so i'm gonna switch the music off oh you know what uh, let's start talking to the car hey bmw 11 Sunlight Park Road. Could you try once again? 11 Sunlight Park Road. Please repeat or say help. I think someone deactivated that feature. So, destination input. If possible, make a legal U turn and then go straight. Okay, so this car does have the augmented reality, and when we get closer to my turn, it's gonna pick up the uh, the camera is gonna bring up the view on the screen, which is placed in the windshield right here, the top view camera. So nice. Uh, just immediately when you start exploring the drive quality is just completely different steering feel you can actually feel like a nice connection with the car look at all the the crystal shifter the crystal uh, eye drive controller uh, the crystal on the seat adjustments and the door controls all that good stuff uh, this one is with the Harman Kardon sound system uh, some of the displays you can change here uh, by the settings and you can change the displays here so if you see content layout head-up display and i don't know if you guys can see the head-up display guys look at this massive display this is gorgeous so i was just in the tesla unfortunately it doesn't offer head-up display this one does you know bmw has been doing head-up display from years this is the new id8 so idrive 8 the latest gen which moving forward the new cars will come with and guys this massive head-up display is just amazing i hope you guys can see it on camera uh, i'm trying my best to show you what i can if possible make a legal u-turn and then go straight uh let's deactivate uh voice control on this There you go.
Hey BMW. Uh, someone deactivated that feature. Hello. <laughs> what can I help you with? I know it's so, it's so easy gorgeous. to use that sensitive it's really nice even this like all the rest is so much nicer than yeah the soft touch material yeah and this one does have the air suspension guys so your activation button right here is for the air suspension um you know what let's activate the brake regeneration there we go so b is on now i can actually drive the car with one foot so I don't need to put my foot on the brake. Just x-ray the car goes and when I lift off my foot from the x-ray the car starts braking for me. Uh, in the Tesla I didn't see that option. Uh, in the BMW yes you do have the option. It's right here. Uh, drive or B for brake regeneration. Uh, so when you go to drive mode it kind of simulates uh, driving very close to a regular gas engine car where you would have to push the brakes. It does have some regeneration in the background, but not as much as uh, we have in the B mode, which is the brake regeneration. So that's there you have it that's the augmented reality so i went on a quick drive yesterday on it's a dryer like sunny it was a beautiful drive man we gotta push it on the highway fortunately i didn't have my camera on me so i can record it uh today it's been snowing it's a little wet so we're gonna take it a little bit easier, uh, but let's so push it on the highway a bit if we can. Okay, so my turn's coming up, my exit's coming up. Oh, that was it breaking again. Okay. Come on, lady, let's go. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> that's pretty crazy. Yeah, man, that's 516 horsepower. <laughs> oh, wow. This is awesome. So our exit's coming up in a bit. Guys, I don't know if you can hear how quiet it is inside.
Hey BMW, activate sport mode. Which of these modes do you need? Let's go. <laughs> Ooh, this is fun. As you can feel the suspensions tighten up. I think the car uh, lowers the suspensions. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, all the G-force you feel. Look at that. The handling on these bends are just phenomenal. It doesn't move, it just holds its ground. Look at that. there's even an efficient mode that you can turn it into and that will conserve more power give you obviously extend your range uh, make it a more conservative drive we are in the sport mode right now and there's a more normal mode which is equivalent to the comfort mode uh, for all you BMW drivers who are used to that oh man this guy just this car just wants to go I tap the accelerator and just floor it just goes <laughs> just pushes me back into my seat this is fun I wonder how this will do on the track honestly all this power guys there you have it I'm driving it on your behalf that's a beautiful comfortable drive seats are amazing so comfy the tough fitted stitching the fit and finish of the car all around you will feel it guys if you guys are comparing this with the Tesla definitely go check the Tesla out go for a drive come back here we'll give you a drive on this if you have one and you'll see what i mean look at that massive head-up display it just bring up the whole maps and just wow So this car does have the advanced driver assistance package built in. Unfortunately, those features for our test drive have been deactivated. Uh, so I couldn't show those to you, but it does have your active cruise control, your lane assist, steering wheel assist, uh, auto lane changing. All those stuff that I've, I've uh, shown in my previous videos. 
All right, guys, so we're shortly pulling up uh, to BMW Toronto. If you guys have questions, please write me in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do subscribe to the channel. Uh, like the video, click on the bell icon for more informative content like this, and do share the video with family and friends. turns coming up you can see the augmented reality uh, video come up on my screen and those large arrows showing you where I need to turn exactly all right Reza you ready for your drive now yeah, it's gonna be fun um, okay while you drive I'll get on my other camera and record this Sure, it looks straight out like a video game. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Camera quality is so good. It's 4K. Yeah. Yeah, so the BMW uses 4K uh, HDR camera, so we have full best resolution. Stop, stop, stop. And just back it in for you. Cool. Thank you. All right, guys, so there you have it. That was the IX. Uh, I'm just gonna show it to you from the outside. Yeah, very cold there. You can see the icicles forming there. And that's the Tesla just pulled in. Uh, winter tires on it for now. All right, guys, I'll try and compile these videos in one and I'll see you guys shortly with my other camera. Uh, and now it's this is not in uh brake mode, right? So, no, it's not okay, it's in your regular drive mode. All right, guys, so we're in the, we are back in the 2022 BMW iX X Drive 50. And I have my colleague here with me, Reza. Reza, say hi for YouTube. What's going on, guys? Hey, hey. So, guys, if you're looking for a car, you come to him, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, yeah, previously I was driving with my GoPro on. We did a POV video. So, what I see is what you see. And now this is from my other camera. I am sitting in the passenger seat uh, to show you the drive of the BMW iX. What a difference from the Tesla. Right immediately you yeah, feel it. Yeah, you just like so much more yeah. premium quality. Yeah, yeah. It's, like much more elegance. Let's look at this curved display, guys. This is awesome. That's so cool. The indicator is on and look, it's on in the wire. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> okay, so this car does have gesture control. Here is the camera above you. Uh, fun fact, you can actually take selfies with this camera. 
if you have a fun uh, road trip, it can take a picture of all of you guys in the car if you tell it to. So it's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, it's also this camera and the cameras outside is also for theft. So yes, finally now in the BMW, the drive recorder can record theft. So if it uh, notices anyone messing with your car, the cameras will come on and will record it interior and exterior. And if you guys look at the uh, panorama sunroof panel, right now it's at a clear setting. So just a push of the button right here. So if I push it, see what happens, it goes translucent. So really, really cool. Uh, haven't seen it on any of the other competitors yet. Yeah, I'm gonna play with a bit of settings. Let's see. Personal assistant is on. Wait, what is on? Hey, BMW. 11 Sunlight Park Road. Okay, I've selected 11 Sunlight Park Road. Whoa! See the power on this? This is crazy. Guys, you saw the camera move. I literally got pushed back to my seat. That's how much G-force you feel. The power is just unexplainable. Like you cannot explain it. You have to experience this. 516 horsepower. Can you imagine when the M60 is launched? Oh my God, that's like close to 600 horsepower there. <laughs> it literally, look at this guy, he's laughing. Like it literally puts a smile on your face every single time. instant torque. Yeah. ABMW. Hey, oh, Try it again. ABMW. Hey, Put it in sport mode. Sorry, I didn't quite hear that. Hey, BMW. Activate. Once again, or say hello. Hey BMW, activate sport mode. I didn't understand you again. Maybe these sample commands can help you out. No worries. Drive train, chassis. Oh, you I'm can sorry select. that I didn't understand you again. Maybe. difference but we'll see on the third. Yeah. I got the structure in front of me. <laughs> see the handling difference here? Yeah. This versus the Tesla. Oh my god, this is like night and day, night and day. bend handles really well so let me show you around that's your wireless charging tray right down there uh, you have your cup holders dual USB-C chargers 12 volt charging your iDrive controller that is opted with the crystal uh, volume knob some shortcut keys the gear selector if you look on the door uh, the 
the seat adjustments, the memory seating, all that stuff crystallized. So really, really cool stuff. Just the shape of the steering wheel itself. It's amazing. Look at that. And really fun to drive with it. The uh, the grip you have on the steering wheel is just, it's just on par. leathers the fit and finish everything is there guys so if you haven't watched my other video where i show you the car in detail inside and out please find that video on my channel go watch it this is specifically for the drive for those of you who who said to me you know what i haven't driven the car i want to drive one i want to feel it here this is me all smiles throughout the drive it's a really really fun drive guys must drive it must own it beautiful car if you're thinking electric car look no further this is it look how quiet it is in the cabin i cannot hear anything from the outside that little bit of sound you can hear inside that of the ionic uh, sounds oh the car just takes off holy moly quiet so you can hear the sounds how it sounds like inside it's very very quiet super luxurious the seats are so comfortable to sit on soon you're gonna take it through a tight u-turn and we'll test the turning radius on it this is a pretty big car uh, it's the same width as a BMW X5 slightly shorter than an X5 uh, the rear occupants have same room as the BMW X7 that's how roomy it is on the inside have it it's a tight and it makes it so much more room left to yeah. the right yeah it is much better braking is so smooth too yeah you need to apply a little bit of force and oh did you want to try the b the oh, brake yeah, sure. regeneration there you go let's, let's do that so, so i toggle pedal. through the brake regeneration on now and now next time he takes his foot off the accelerator the car stops starts slowing down itself and it can come to a complete stop without even putting your foot on the brake so two benefits there you get brake regeneration so more power to the battery you extend yeah. your range on top of that you're saving so much of your brake pads so you're extending your brake life so guys here we are back at bmw toronto just rolling in again this is samir Moore from bmw toronto please do subscribe to the channel like the video click on the bell icon for more informative content like this and do comment below what you liked about this video what else you would like to see if you had any questions uh you know ask me in the comments and as time permits i'll answer those questions for you
Ooh. It can park itself. Uh, let's, uh, do it. let's see. I need to detect the lines though, no? Please press brake pedal to start maneuvering. Let's see. Yeah, so it's... Uh, no, it'll be confused because it's yeah. there's a lot of snow and stuff, yeah. so I don't know which kind of parking it's doing. Yeah. Let's do, uh, let's just reverse it. Yeah. And detect the lines. So this car does have all the advanced driver assistance aid, including parallel perpendicular parking, backup assistant, you name it, this car has got it all. So it just depends how you package it. And there you go. Start stop right there. Awesome, that was fun. <laughs> yeah. So hope you guys enjoyed it, guys. Again, say hi um, to Reza right here. Hi guys, have a good one. And I'll finish the video by showing you a bit more on the outside of it. Uh, so this is how it looks on the inside. Look at the seat, the stitching, the tough fitted. It's gorgeous, super comfortable. Wireless charging, cup holders. Just amazing fit and finish. I'm gonna show you the rear seat. So lots of room, bottle holders on the door, cup holders on the armrest, pulled on armrest, tons of room, USB-C charging right there, travel and comfort system. You can attach an iPad holder, suit jacket holder, etc. etc. Uh, let me also show you the trunk space really quick. So guys, the key is not on me and the car locked. So unfortunately, the driver of the car walked away with the key, so it locked. Uh, but yeah, it, this is the car for you. So comfort access is set up where the driver walks away, the car locks. If you walk close to the car, it can unlock. This is the Phytonic Blue Metallic. And comes with 22 inch wheels. This one, however, for winter, we did put 20 inch winter tires on it. Sorry guys, really messy out today. I wish it was a more clearer day so I could show you the car better. Uh, but you know what? We got a good test of it in the winter time. This is your all year round car, man. All wheel drive IX X Drive 50 with 516 horsepower. So guys, it was a pleasure showing you around uh, taking it for a drive and again if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do go ahead and subscribe uh, click on the bell icon for more informative content like this like the video and comment below and i'll see you guys on the next one welcome to bmw Toronto.